So, um, I've had to buy another pair of shoes, which is a bit disappointing because the other ones were a bit too small around my like foot box area and I was getting numb toes. Wasn't great. So, I'm on pair of boots number four. Ugliest mm. in town. Ugliest boots in town, but hey, there we go. They're doing all right so far. Vermont is not disappointing yet again. It's stunning. Day 135 and this was our camp spot last night, we had a quick dip in the river, it was freezing. Oh it was freezing today, it was freezing this morning. I'm really really pleased all the winter kits coming back on like in two days time. And I've got oh. mine for a delicious uh, maple syrup Vermont, maple syrup stick to go in my porridge. Sure it's not from Canada? <laughs> no, it's definitely from Vermont and it tastes so good, it's really really good. Oh and also we're going to Rutland today. To the 12 tribes to stay at the 12 tribes yellow deli yeah but i think it's called a spiritual community or something yeah but i think they like god as well yeah, i didn't say they didn't like god no i know but it's a bit misleading that spiritual community <laughs> so we'll see how that goes That was a glimpse of a red do. squirrel. I've got to talk quietly because there's people trying to sleep. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't believe So I thought I'd better tell everyone what my trail name is, since we're uh, only 500 miles before we get to Maine. And you got it before mine. Uh, yeah, and I got it pretty, well, not pretty early on, well, yeah. Um, so it's Scavenger, purely because. I always am asking people what they're eating because we're in a different country. I don't know what everything is. She steals things out of everybody else's food bags. <laughs> I don't steal things. I say, ooh, what's that you've got? I don't think we've got that in Britain. And then they normally let me have a try of it, which is pretty good. Um, and also our couple name, which we got pretty early on. Well, they've got uh, a 100 mile mark, we've got the couple name. Yeah, is the royal couple. That's what most people know is that's on the trail. I'd yeah, say. people go, oh, you're the royal couple. So, yeah, that's us. So, Scavenger Slosh, aka the royal couple. That's us. That's us. <laughs> Very cool shelter. These crazy plants, they kind of look like naff Christmas decorations, but they're actually real plants. We're on top of Killington Hill. Well, a mountain, I think, really. It's pretty spectacular. It's pretty busy. It's the weekend. We're here in Rutland, Vermont. <laughs> Might have had a beer or two. Uh, strange Looking very bar. sexy. Oh yeah, I was going to mention the outfit. So <laughs> it's an amazing high hostel, but they have clothes that you can pick, and this was the best outfit I could come up with. Well, I'm rocking the MC Hammer look. <laughs> And, but hang on a second, you haven't seen Simon. Here he is. He's he's there in his small t-shirt and his 34 waist jeans. <laughs> and his crocs. So it's day something, 30 something. <laughs> um, we've just been to Rutland and resupplied, stayed at the Yellow Deli, which was uh, fun. Owned by the 12 tribes. It was pretty cool. Um, yeah, and we're now at Main Junction. So... Long trail goes that way to Canada, AT goes that way to Maine. I think we'll go to Maine. Day 137 and Simon's just been to the post office, so yeah. I've got boots. But I've got many other birthday many treats snacks. as well. Uh -oh. And we've got lots of full food bags as well. Yes, we've got lots of lovely things, but very... Mom sent me these to put them in here. I'm obviously looking a bit of a mess on the trail. They're like liven me up. And lots of other delicious things. Thank you everyone. Whoa! This one is definitely a hit, this bar that my mum sent from the UK. But unfortunately, this is what it says on the label. Uh, what does it say? It says, gleefully made in Britain. So, oh, there we go. unless we start importing them, there's um, not much chance. It's really good. So apparently I'm becoming a window cleaner now, out here. <laughs> um, not the best with heights, but this seems pretty secure. It's not really a height though, is it? 
Well, I'd rather not fall down there. <laughs> <laughs> it might take me a while. Or 15 feet. <laughs> really impressive. It's dark. <laughs> it's a bit dark. So the nights are drawing in. It's now just after half seven and um, we've done about 19 miles, especially with our late start with the presents and cards and fun things like that. Um, but Simon's worked out now that if he holds a carry in front of me, I'll do more miles and possibly move quicker. So Wednesday, it's now Monday. As long as we walk 43 miles, we'll be going to the Ben and Jerry's ice cream factory. Which oh, yeah, it's a good carrot. <laughs> <laughs> Super excited. So, yeah, got to crab in those miles. And the boots, new boots. Well, new boots. New you haven't said that you've got new boots. Yeah, I had this morning. Oh, yeah. On the video. Okay. Anyway, third pair of boots. Yeah, fine. New t shirt. Not so good for dirt. What did I expect? I live in the woods. <laughs> the last day in Vermont today. Nice views. To finish off on it. Excellent state. Stopped at this nice idyllic spot for lunch. And also picked up some trail magic on the way, so we've got a cold drink. Yeah. <laughs> Loving walking through all the big tall pines. Pretty cool around here. Love you, Vermont. So Simon's going for the jump off the bridge, which I'm not partaking in. Flick there, he did okay, 139 and there's our very stealth campsite last night. <laughs> we literally couldn't find anywhere flat to put the tent. That's so what happens when you turn up at night when you've got to get to Ben and Jerry's. Oh no, it was pretty dark when we turned up on this like mega hill. Ben and Jerry's today though. <clears throat> so here we are. That's it. It's the second to last one. Vermont, New Hampshire! Oh, truck going past the centre! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! So we heard that New Hampshire is just like flat, so yeah, good fun. Yeah. So we're here at the Ben and Jerry's factory. <laughs> here we go, into the tour. Whoa, there's a lot of ice cream flavours. <laughs> this is where all the flavours come to die. Poor flavours. Into the cheese place now. Off we go. Apparently, it's makers of the world's best cheddar. It's never going to be the world's best cheddar. We're here at the uh, maple syrup like place. I've got an audience now. I'm about the video. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we've just seen a really good video at the maple syrup place. That's all I've got, really. That's all you've got. Ah. Did you taste any maple syrup? Oh, Anything else oh, happened yeah, here? Yeah, it was really delicious. We've had loads of maple syrup. Oh. <laughs> any treats to die. He'll definitely give you a kiss now. Come on. <laughs> Day 140, we think. Uh, so we're suffering a little bit after all the... Oh, ice cream. Well, all the deliciousness of yesterday. <laughs> cheese. Curry. Oh, we went for a curry as well. <laughs> so, um, yeah, not the best day today. But anyway, um, we learned at the maple syrup place that this is like... Um, uh, rather than the old taps that they used to just put a metal thing in in a bucket, they had put up these systems of like piping. But apparently the squirrels like it too, so they like getting at the piping, eating the syrup stuff. But yeah, now we know the mystery has been solved. Oh well, we thought it was a mystery to us. <laughs> but it's for maple syrup. There we go. Bit of a rant there. Check out the fun sign. We love it. The spruce moose. So here's old. Flat old New Hampshire. That's the whites over there. We're going up all them mountains. Can't even see the top of that one. It's probably snowing up there. So I think it's day 141. It's the afternoon. Um, it absolutely hammered it down all morning. Found out my boots are not waterproof. No shocker there, as nothing is waterproof in the Appalachian Mountains apparently. Um, yeah, it was a pretty wet morning, but I did get the tent down before it started raining, so school there. That's about it, really. Hi oh, then. Oh, yeah, have found some hills in New Hampshire. <laughs> 
Pretty hilly. Okay, it's a bit dark right. because it's getting a bit late, but here we are. Welcome to the whites. Ow, mosquito. So, do a little video of this is a guidebook we carry, the AT guidebook by David A. Woolmiller, A. Wool's trail name. Um, and this basically shows us where everything is. Like if you look down the page, here's the miles, this is like page one, so Springer Mountain, zero miles. And you follow it down, it tells you where all the water is, tells you where all the shelters is. And, um, and this line here, you can be read this way, this is the elevation, so these are the hills. So, this is Georgia, which was no picnic. Like, Georgia is pretty hilly, as you can see. Um, if we flick forwards, like, this is like Pennsylvania, as we know, it was very rocky, but was very flat. Um, and then this. This is today, or yesterday, so it's pretty hilly. Pretty hilly. And then this is the end of today. Look at that. Whoop! Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. So that's like 1,000 feet to nearly 5,000 feet. Lovely. Um, and yeah, like this is basically what we're uh, dealing with over the next couple of weeks through the whites. It's, um, it, looks, it looks super, super easy, super flat.